Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for today, tomorrow. Let's see what we got. Hold on, a piece of hair on my shirt. What do we have? What do we have? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe. Ooh, Ten of Swords reversed. So this is freedom, liberation. It is the end. It's the end of something. This is literally being broken free. End of a painful situation that, you know, somebody has been suffering and and it's just about over or or it is. It's over. It's over. Oh, this is what I saw, but I didn't want to say it because I didn't want to scare anybody. But this is when, when I first started talking, I was going to say, I see the tower. Here we go. I do see the tower. Now you see it too. I've been seeing it coming. Here it is. So. I should focus. I got that out of the way. There we go. So we have a tower moment. Something is crumbling. Something is crumbling, probably very, very fast. Somebody may be shook. They may be shook um, or definitely shaken up. This is your rude awakening. This is a necessary evil. When I first started this reading, the very first card I saw in my head was the tower. So we have uh, some sort of disruption a major disruption the light is being shed it's like it's like some some sort of false foundation has been cracked right open built on false pretenses looks like this needs to happen this is a universal change this is the universe stepping in to force a change this is forced change because somebody has been suffering and that's not fair so this is this is this is a, a big moment big it's like all of a sudden things just hit boom like that Three of Cups, Seven of Cups. Now, this is in regards to relationships. Since it's in regards to third-party situations, somebody has made a poor decision, and now they're probably confused. They may be in a state of confusion. What do I do now? What do I do now, now that something has been revealed? Because the, the, something has cracked open with the tower, or it is about to, and something is being shown, something is being revealed. It's like all of a sudden, you have no choice but to uh, do something differently. Now we have choices, right? Be careful with your choices because there's consequences. There's always consequences for the choices that you make. So somebody may have made a poor decision. Something is definitely completing. We have a 10 here. 3 plus 7 is 10. Then we have the tower. We have a completion here. Something is ending. And it has to do with a relationship of some sort. And there is multiple forms of relationships. This is disruption and destruction and forced universal change. And it's a shock. It's a shock. May have to do with a child. Could be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. 
any kind of child, but somebody hasn't been telling the truth. There's a conflict that that is on the table here. We could be dealing with a Scorpio as well. Is, uh, is there a child that's not being loved? Somebody's not being loved. What's that? There's a lack of love here. A loss, a loss of emotional support. A loss of love. Somebody's not being loved. Somebody's not getting the love that they deserve. Looks like that's about to end. Loss of love. Somebody's not getting the love that they deserve. Somebody may have been shutting down. They have been, been shutting down, not allowing somebody to be loved. It's crazy, people, what they do. There's grieving. There's sadness. We do have somebody here that is sad. We have somebody that here that is very sad. We could have a... I don't know if it's a child or it's a mother or who it is. Somebody is crying. Somebody is absolutely crying. No doubt. <laughs> very, very sad. We also have somebody here that is worried. Somebody that is worried. Somebody that is stressed. This person has been thinking about what to do, what should I do, what should I do, what should I do, this person has, this person is worried, I think this is, has to do with, with children, we do have somebody here that is very, very worried, we have somebody here that is thinking, thinking about love, very discontent, we definitely, we could have two people that are thinking, and what should I do? This is, bare, this is really what this is. What should I do? We have somebody here that's been, that, that's been missing the opportunity. It's like they know there's an opportunity for love. They know there's an opportunity for somebody to be loved, but they aren't allowing it or they're not taking it. It's crazy. It's crazy. Confusion. This part, this is confusion, and this is confusion. We got somebody here that is really confused. It's like they know that there's a big opportunity for love for somebody, but for some reason they won't take it or they won't allow it or something like that. Six of Swords. Now this is transition. This is moving on. This is going to a better place. It's like they don't... Now, this is needing to go to a better place. Somebody, This is needing to go to a better place. Somebody needs to go. They need to go to a better place. They have to. Mm, somebody has been fighting authority. Right? The Hierophant reversed. This is somebody that is having a hard time doing the right thing due to society because of social pressure. Somebody is being controlled probably by a father figure who is questioning his authority. It's like he wants to have the authority. There's like a father figure here who wants to have authority, but it's not in the right manner. It's all about social pressure. This person can't do the right thing because of society. He wants to prove that he, you know, has the authority. That's the meaning of this card in reverse. He may have received poor counsel from his friends who know nothing. Or from people that have no expertise. This is poor counsel, friends.
We have somebody here that is 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 really probably feeling guilty. The, this person is probably feeling guilty, definitely feeling stressed out about their choices, about their decisions, about what they want to do, where they want to go, how they want to handle this situation. It's like when I fight authority, authority always wins. Yeah. But this, this person has definitely been fighting authority. They want to have all the authority. They don't want to listen. They have no faith and trust. This person is probably um, not very spiritual. They may be in a relationship where they're no longer on the same page with the person that they were with. But they're fighting it because of society. Meanwhile, we have somebody over here who's not being loved is very, very sad, just wants to be loved, and deserves to be loved. But this person wants the power, wants the authority. The moment of decision, the two of wands, you're at a crossroads, somebody's at a crossroads, now they get they have to choose, they have to make a choice. What do you do now? This is a time it's it's kind of a restless period, it's a restless time where somebody is feeling definitely discontent. Uh, they don't know what to do. They they don't know whether they should uh Go this way or that way. Somebody is torn. Somebody is really, really torn. But this two of wands is that moment of decision. So there's, there's, and, and there, there's a decision here. But we have this father figure that really wants to be in control. It's all about power and control. Okay, it's not about love. We have this moment of decision. You get to choose. What are you going to do? The time is up. There's no more growth here. As you notice, it's harvest time. It's, the season is over. This season is over. It's like you had your chance to make it grow. You had your chance to nurture it. You can't get any more out of it. It's time to go someplace else. King of Wands. This is somebody who takes action. The King of Wands uh, makes a decision. This person is very protective. Very protective. So we have a very protective individual here who has just experienced a tower moment. This is a tower moment for this person. Ooh, the devil. The devil, the devil is ruled by greed, lust. Obsessions. Control, manipulation, addictions. We have somebody here that has been trying to control. Seriously, control, control, control. Trying to be in control. I want control. This is about control. That's what this is about. It's not about love. So it feels like we today is a day of, of this person that has been trying to control for all the wrong reasons because the devil is all the wrong reasons. And this person is experiencing a disruption, courtesy, 
of the universe. The time is up. Page of Wands. Page of Wands is uh, news arriving. This is news arriving. Somebody is it may receive an invitation or they re may receive a message that leads them down a new path, a new adventure. This is a this is a positive message. This is good news. Somebody's going to receive good news. Whatever this good news is. Could have to do again with a child, may not be. But this is good news arriving. There's an end of a contract. That is the end of a contract. Perhaps the good news is somebody is deciding to end a false contract. I mean, the lovers reversed. That is the end of a contract. It's conflict with somebody that you're not compatible with. Somebody is going to receive the news that this contract is over. There's been some sort of breakdown. That is a breakdown. There's been some sort of breakup or breakdown or uh, disaster or clean out or something like that. Something has happened that has caused a major disturbance. And this has happened because somebody is meant to be broken free from a troublesome situation where there was no love. Somebody has been grieving, they've been sad, they've been crying. And it's like the universe says, it's time, it's time, it's time. It's time to break, the, break this up. It's time to break up this false contract. Yeah, there's a change in the family dynamics. Four of Wands. Somebody may have been living in an unhappy home. Oh, it may have to do with children. It does have to do with children. This has to do with children. I'm sorry, but it does. If it does, if it's not children, if you don't have any children, it could be you. We we have we have a unhealthy relationship here with that devil card with somebody that is not being loved. Somebody's not feeling loved. They're not getting the love that they deserve. They're not getting love at all. It's not about love, it's about power and control. And the universe says no. No. I think it's going to be in a very emotional time. It is very emotional. It's very emotional. On one hand, it's emotional. On the other hand, it's exciting. There's an exciting change. So I think we have somebody here that is, whoever this person is, they, they're, they're feeling both sides. On one hand, they're, they're sad and they're tearful and they're scared. But on the other hand, they're excited. They're excited. They're, they're ready to break free. They are absolutely ready to break free from this prison. So today is a day of moving. This is moving. This is literally moving. I think somebody is going to make a decision that love matters more and somebody is moving. So this is going to a better place. 
Somebody may be taking somebody to a better place. Somebody is going to receive a message that excites them. It does excite them. I think that we have somebody that, that is going to make a decision. It's like fight. It's like when I fight authority, authority always wins. Somebody is going to make an authoritative decision against the one that is obsessed, the one that is not doing the right thing. There's going to be a decision that is made. To end a contract. And bring somebody to a better place. Decision. This is somebody who is, is, is makes the decision. A decision is being made. There's going to be tears. Definitely I see tears. I do see tears. Change is never easy, ever. <laughs> Once in a while, not not very, not this kind of change, not this kind of change. Somebody had their heart set on a person that was a literally emotionally unavailable, and they were clinging to that person. And it was causing them a lot of confusion. They were making the wrong choice. They weren't seeing that there was a better opportunity. But now something is going to happen that changes their perspective. Everything is about to change. Put it that way with the Tower card. Be prepared for a huge shock. One card, please. Indecision. I use my intuition in all aspects of life. And there's a lot of indecision here. That two of wands under there and this. And even with the lover's card reversed. Somebody has made some poor decisions. They've been indecisive. Uh, they've caused somebody to be really hurt and sad. Um, they've caused a lot of tears. I think the tears are still happening. I think that... Uh, something is going to happen that is going to force a decision it's like you can't make the decision you can't make the right decision let me make it for you and i'm not saying me this is this is somebody in authority this is an authoritative figure so it's like it's a it's a it's it's about authority so that is what i have i think that authority is about to make a decision that is what Today is about war tomorrow or something like that. Good luck.